hello friends in this video we are going to share a folder of our raspberry pi with windows so that we can access this folder through windows this will make our most of work easy in our upcoming projects just like if we have captured a image from our usb webcam and we want to see this then we will have to Oh, copy this to the share folder and we will access it through our windows so first log into the uh, our raspberry pi enter the ip address and hit enter now enter the username and password and you are logged in so now to make a share folder or share a folder we need some package so we have to install the samba in our raspberry pi so use the command sudo apt-get install samba samba common bin and install it this will take a few minutes to install so wait for the installation complete and we will start with this so currently my installation process is running Finally, the process of installation is completed. So we have installed the Samba in our Raspberry Pi. So now we have to configure the Samba to share uh, our folder. So we will open favorite editor. I am using Nano. Nano etc Samba SMP config. Okay, this is the simple configuration file of Samba and here is some global settings so we have to confirm the name of workgroup variable uh, here the value of group group variable is default to workgroup and in our windows it also named to workgroup so make sure the name of workgroup is same in your configuration file and your windows so uh, I think you don't have to change this name the next is pin support variable you have to uncomment this and change is to yes so that is support to our windows rest of the configuration file is ok for our project so left as it is and save this file now we are going to create a share folder uh, to share with our windows so make a directory name shared you can change according to your so use mkdir name of your share folder m using your share and the directory is created and you can see here here is our directory name share now I have to change the permission of our newly created directory share directory so sudo csmod oops I forget to use csmod so csmod plus triple seven and name of directory that you have created you can see it here and I give all the permission to it So now we have to add some code in our Samba configuration file. So open it again with sudo nano etc samba conf and add some code at the end of the file. I already have added the code, so you can copy and paste this code. Yet PC adds it tells about the section in our file and here is the path to the folder that we have created and uh, we created the share folder in our root so the home pi share is the path for the file and make it uh, some other variables so you don't have to worry just copy and paste and we have made it pub public is equal to yes that's when we don't need username and password to access this okay this is all we have to configure in this file so save it 
and exit okay now we are going to the share folder that we created and shared and here we are going to make a test file mm, that's hello.txt so nano hello.txt oops add something like hello from pi and save it yeah we have saved you can check now we are going to our windows to check whether the folder is shared or not so go to windows open the explorer now go to the network here the Raspberry Pi will be shown and here this is our Raspberry Pi double click it <coughs> and this is the shared folder we just shared with Pi share name open it and here is the file we just created the hello.txt yeah this is our hello.txt name hello from Pi hi Pi so I am going to write down hello pi and save it yeah save oops we have some access problem so we have to go back and change the access oh, we don't have access here for our hello.txt so go back in previous directory cd by and we have to assign the permission again to whole directory of share folder yeah it's done the permission given go back to the windows and try to edit it again hello pi now save it save oh yes this is saved so we have write permissions we have written the file check it with in our raspberry pi just get the file name and here is our hello pi you can open it with your browser sorry your <laughs> text editor nano and this is the file we did it from our windows now in windows we are going to make another file just to check our right permissions so make a new file new and new text document and give it name any and check in the raspberry pi with ls and here is this win.txt that we created from windows so this is how we share a folder with windows in our raspberry pi thanks if you like this you can like and subscribe our channel you can also share with your friends so till the next video bye bye